Obviously, Ryan had a lot of pace in and it was unfortunate what happened to him off the start. Um, but um, luckily for us, that made our race a little bit a little bit easier, um, but still obviously had to get the job done, still couldn't forget what we set out there to do, and luckily we did that. Um, can't feel any better, obviously doing it at a home track like this, obviously got my whole family around here and a few friends as well, so yeah, really happy with how the car was, um, and yeah, we'll just see how we go tomorrow in the reverse grid race. Yeah, p was good way to finish today after finishing P3 and qualifying. The wind picked up a little bit of pace then, just didn't quite catch uh, Jaden in time for, to have a race with him, so by the end we really need to start looking after the tyres instead of trying to push on and catch him because we've still got two more races tomorrow and those two count big time, so we really got to try and save the tyres so we can be very competitive tomorrow. Yeah, that was a bit of a mixed bag of emotions in that race. Um, yeah, we had incredible pace, but uh, yeah, uh, launched it off the line, got a fair bit of wheel spin over the front line, that, uh, the line that crosses the front row, and then pulled second and it just cut out, so had to turn all the main and everything off and pretty much come to a stop, got going again, it was uh, eight seconds or so behind the field, and just sort of got into a bit of a zone and tried my best to set down some good times and maybe improve a little bit from quali uh, and really get a feel for what uh, used tyres feel like for the next couple of races but no to have pace is fantastic because that's what we need in the reverse grid race later today uh, tomorrow not today